Lord, we magnify your name, Lord. We give you glory, the Lord of heaven. The Lord, the owner of heaven and earth. The owner. The earth, the fullness thereof is yours. All of the earth is yours. The fullness thereof. Thank you, Lord. Psalmist David said, if I ascend to the highest heights of heaven, Lord, you're there. No wonder he called himself I am to Moses. Because no matter where you go, he already is I am. And then he said, if I go to the lowest depths, and he said, of hell. What he was saying, the lowest depths of anything I can imagine. Lord, you're already there. And what he was really saying in our vernacular today is if I went to the tip end of the telescope, if I journeyed with the Hubble and was able to see other galaxies in this universe, this ever-expanding universe, if, no matter what detail I can derive with my eye and see, God already is there. And every star that you discover every week after week after week, every star, the Lord already not only knows it, but knows it by name. No matter at the end of the telescope, He's already there. Oh, but the other thing that thrills me is at the end of the microscope, at the very end of where they began to realize that, that, that life, all its ability to live and the nucleus of this and the, and, the, and, the, and, the, and the protons and the neutrons and all the firing and all that and how that all works, all the intricacies way down there to finally get to a thing that, that, 